on St. Armand's. And we love to do a Christmas carol sing along to sing Santa onto the circle. So All right, we are live. We are from St. Armand Circle right here, right now. And why are we here? Because Santa is on his way to light the St. Armand's Christmas tree. That's right. That's what it's all about. And you know what they're doing right now, Heather? Singing Christmas carols. <laughs> That's right. Singing a Christmas carol. Santa Claus is what? Coming to town? Coming to town. I think he's coming on a fire truck. A fire truck? Why is not? this your first time actually coming here? It is. It is. Really? Yes. I've always done the one downtown. Wow. And you know how many years this this has actually been going on? I do. Forty. Forty years? Yes. Like, so it started before I was born. I was just going to say, it's way <laughs> older than me, Sather. <laughs> I was 12. That's right. And Cha-Cha, is this your first time coming in the circle for... No, baby. I live here 20 years. I do it every, every year. And I don't can waiting for Santa now. I love it. Wow, Heather. So I think it's a matter of moments, and then yes. Santa Claus actually is going to light that tree that's yes, right behind us. Santa, it's my understanding that Santa's going to go all the way around the circle, and then he comes right here and right over Cha-Cha's shoulder, back here where the Sarasota High School Choir is singing, he's going to go up there and light that tree. Wow, exciting. So what are some of the things that you're going to ask Santa Claus for Christmas? Oh, I'm that, eats love and kindness yes, or something like that. I was that. just gonna say I'm that girl oh that's. God. I'm I gonna want, vomit. I know. I want <laughs> help for my children and grandchildren, health and happiness. For I my think baby. that helicopter may have Santa Claus in it. What do you think? What if What if Santa Claus just completely falls right out of the helicopter and parachutes right here on St. Armand's? That'd be amazing. I, I would just move out of his way. <laughs> And Cha Cha, I gotta ask you, what did you ask Santa Claus for Christmas? You know what? I like only be happy and healthy. This is all what I wish. You know what I mean? This is most important in my life. Be happy and healthy. Thank you, Santa. <laughs> all right. No, Tyler. No. What do you want? Oh, 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 it's all about me. Oh, look, there he is. I think that really is Santa right I'm in sure the helicopter. That's a Coast Guard helicopter. I'm oh. almost positive. <laughs> you sure? Let's see, what would I like? Mm. You know, I feel like I kind of have everything. I have the show, which thanks to our viewers have made it possible for and me to enjoy. And you have us! It. I know, I definitely have you guys. I mean, what would I be without you guys, right? Lost, confused, and angry. <laughs> I really do think that helicopter is going to just land right here with Santa Claus. <laughs> If it's not a helicopter, it may be a UFO. What do you think, Cha-Cha? No, Santa come definitely here. He don't come from heaven. No, no, no. Uh-oh. Look. Oh, there comes Santa, actually. Cha-Cha. Fire truck, right? Gotta go film Santa. Yeah. That or someone's going to Sarasota Memorial. It's definitely Santa. Well, this has to be one of the first times that I've been down here where it's been this crazy. I mean, oh. last year when I was here, it yeah. was it was really, really busy. But this year, I would say there's probably twice as many people here tonight. There's definitely twice as many necklaces. Um, they must have been selling these necklaces half off. Do you see them? Everybody's oh, got the, the lights, same yeah. light necklaces. They're so cool. We should have had those. Yeah, we should have. Cha-Cha loves bling bling things. Should we have Cha-Cha show the crowd or should yes, we wait? Yes, of course. Cha-Cha, why don't you show our viewers what we're actually looking at? Can you run and go show the viewers? Yes. <laughs> the helicopter is, um, I feel like I need to scream. Oh, Cha-Cha is showing everyone right now. Children. Children and more children. I hope she doesn't get run over by that fire truck that's getting ready to come right where she's at. They'll see her dress. It's bling bling. And you didn't warn her to get out of the way. I didn't. And she's about to get in trouble now. She's going to cha-cha, our very own cha-cha, in trouble. What is this you speak of? All right, cha-cha. You said that like she can hear you. Come on back, cha-cha. Come back on to back. us, cha-cha. Go over and there. You, you know that's not going to happen, I'll so you got to go help her. 
Cha Cha, yes. you're not a good camera person. I'm sorry. I am good camera person. You didn't put the camera back there. We got security behind you because you're in the way, blocking Santa Claus trying to get through there. No, I they don't said do behind it. the white line. No, sometimes you really not can't count on a Santa good Cha Cha. Next last minute, you know, next minute come the Santa, Santa, Santa. I don't block nobody. I never block Santa. No, but look at this. People. Look at this happiness. Look at how everybody is exciting. I mean, this is really special, special night here. We have Christmas time. Everybody is happy and exciting. I mean, if your ears start to bleed, you know Cha Cha is around, right, Heather? Whatever he said, I usually agree. Oh, look, this really is happening. This really is happening. Thank you for moving the camera because now Santa Claus can actually get through. Well, are we gonna have? gonna say are we gonna have Cha Cha go film Santa but by the time she does all that he'll be yeah, here. I think we better leave Cha Cha right there. Oh policemen on motorcycles. Yay. We love policemen on motorcycles. All right Heather calm down. And horses. <laughs> Don't get too excited Heather. <laughs> Is Santa in that fire truck? I think Is he's he? gonna pop out of somewhere. Is he coming out of I feel like last year he was like on a sleigh or something. I feel like he's I coming out. I remember there out. was like a sleigh or something. Uh, the back of... Oh! Oh, oh look! Oh my God, was that I your mom, Heather? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's Santa Claus! Santa! I love you! Oh, All right. just rolled in on an old Mustang. <laughs> Come on And we're going to show everybody Santa and all the great things about Santa in just a minute. Yes, so. Santa's rolling in on an Santa old convertible us. Mustang. Only in Florida does that happen. Wow. Oh, my gosh. The Where's the reindeer at? It's the Mustang. He's got all that horsepower. Aww. He doesn't need reindeer. He's he got horsepower. <laughs> I'm not sure what that's going on right <laughs> now. He come here. He may be coming. Oh, here he comes. Look, there's Santa. Oh, All right, let's move out of the way. So what's going to happen now is Santa Claus is going to help light the tree. As you can see, they have a, how many foot tree is that, Heather? Make something really good. 172. <laughs> I was like, make something up really good. So Santa Claus is going to help light the tree and all the decorations and lights that are around St. Norman Circle. Oh, that's right. He's, he's going to so assist the entire in, circle. If you've never been down here, you definitely want to bring your family. It will get you in the mood it's for Christmas. It's beautiful. The, the whole circle. What is happening now? Welcome to the 40th annual Holiday Night of Lights on St. Norman Circle. I want to give a big thank you to um, Melissa Dweck for all that she has done from Sarasota High School, the Sarasota uh, Theater Drama Department teacher, and I would like to give a special thank you to Kirby Saunders and for his direction for the Chamber Choir. Thank you so much. <laughs> it takes a lot to put an event on like this, and so I would like to um, indulge me as I thank our sponsors, if I can see. Um, I'd like to thank Scott and Jim McDonald, who are the sponsors of our Christmas tree and have been for the last 19 years. I would like to thank our sponsors this year, Wagner Realty, Jennifer Mateo Event Planning, So Staged Events, Rena Kay Photography, the Sarasota Magazine, the Observer Media Group, the Sarasota Herald Tribune, the St. Armand Circulization, and all of our wonderful members, and the St. Armand's Business Improvement Group. Let's give them all they can. Of course, we couldn't do this event without our fabulous Sarasota Fire Department and our fabulous Sarasota Police Department. Thank you, everyone. And none of this would be possible without our amazing city electricians, Jan and Kevin. Thank you, thank you. We have something a little different this year, and we have trees that have been donated by Lowe's, and we have uh, seven charities that have come out to decorate those trees, and I would like to thank those charities for the beautiful job that they've done, making Santa's area so beautiful. Lighthouse of Minnesota, 
I need my glasses, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I thought I could do it, I can't. Thank you. Okay. Um, All-Star Children's Foundation, Designing Daughters, Visible Men's Academy, Nate's Honor Animal Rescue, Satchel's Last Resort, and Suncoast Center for Independent Living. Thank you so much. And I would like to thank Revy's Cars for these gorgeous photos, that these cars that were brought in our sponsors in Santa this year. So thank you so much. A big thank you to Kurt Hennard and his crew for installing these decorations. This is a gigantic job and it's a couple of solid weeks that they put into doing this. So Kurt, thank you so much for such an incredible job. I'd also like to thank all of the members of the Residents Association, the Circle Association, and all of our volunteers who came out to help us decorate this fabulous 55-foot Christmas tree. We could not have done it without you. Thank you. Well, you heard it here first. What did you think, Cha Cha? I think this is fantastic. Look at this, this beautiful, beautiful big tree. I don't can waiting for the lighting. Wow, this magic moment, Tyler, really magic moment. I want to thank all people and say our thanks for being so nice to us. Wow. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much, all, and we're This is hard work, and you know. Everybody do and some piece of this work decoration. Yes. From St. Armand's Key Lutheran Church to come up and offer a word of prayer. Wow. Good evening. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Well, about all the people at St. Armand's Key Lutheran Church, thanks for letting me be here tonight. And remember, when the lights are on, walk around the circle. Say hello to all the business owners who are here tonight, ready to serve you. And if you've got a couple of minutes, even stop by the church, right underneath the big cross, we've got a living nativity tonight. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we gather here tonight, people from just round the corner and people from round the globe, people from across the bridge, and people from across the world. We gather here, people of all nations and races and creeds and colors, gathered with one purpose in mind, Lord, to gather as people of life and joy and light in the midst of a dark world and a dark winter. We gather here to shine. So, Father, may the thousand people that are here tonight leave here and go into the world as a thousand points of light, as our late beloved president described it. To go back into this world and share the joy and share the love, especially of this most wonderful time of the year and most special season. But Father, our prayer could not be complete without asking you to watch over the men and women who serve in the armed forces of this country, many of whom are far from home this night and will be far from home throughout the Christmas season. And many of them will be in harm's way. So we who are here and celebrate and rejoice, spare a moment of thought for them and our prayers for them and that they may be home soon to the families who love them and miss them so much. Now, Lord, grace us with light and joy and love this season and all year long. As the people around this tree cry out to you in all the names they have been taught, and as I cry out to you in the name that I was taught, Jesus Christ, our Saviour and Lord. Amen. Amen. Now I'd like to ask Santa and Mrs. Santa and Iva to go down front and light our beautiful tree. All right, the moment we've all been waiting for. This is where Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus, they light the tree. Okay. 
We're gonna count it down as soon as they get there. Okay, are we ready? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Look at that. I mean, these lights all around the circle really do light it up. Cha-cha is amazing, right? Magic happened. Look at this gorgeous Christmas tree. Wow. Look at Heather. She's so nice. She's running the camera. We've got to, yes. got to talk to her. She's the camera lady tonight. Hi, Heather. What do you say for the Christmas tree? Come in, come in, come in. Enjoy us. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. And you know, what a nice thing wow. to pray for. Thank you. I know what you're going to say. Yeah. Thank and you. I know that, I just, I'm not gonna that cry. really, really does <laughs> speak, cry. speak closely to your heart. Yeah. Your, your son, tell our viewers yes. a little bit about your son. Oh, my son serves in the United States Navy. So. Yeah, so that's yeah. a personal. So moment. it's personal. So speaking of personal, these lights, amazing, right? You know, the one thing that we always have to remember is this didn't just happen. The people, the people that were mentioned tonight, a lot of people put a lot of love and dedication into this, and it wouldn't happen without them. And all of the local businesses, whether it's here on St. Armand's or downtown Sarasota, they choose to make this happen for people like you and I. So I'd like to really say thank you to all the businesses as they're being thanked right now and the board of directors. And yes, to say, as the priest said, to, to all of our military and everybody out there that's missing someone right now. Absolutely. You know, this is a time of year that we're all praying for them and for you, and it's a beautiful time of year. And I'd also like to mention something that's very, very important. I mentioned this in the past for other things that we've done. I want to mention that without our sponsors, yes. the local businesses here in Sarasota, yes. the ones that we actually go out and about to show yes. our viewers, we wouldn't, it wouldn't make it possible here yes. in Sarasota. Mm -hmm. And we do appreciate, yes. ma'am, we're in the middle we're of filming. Right. Thank, you. Thank you. We're in the we're middle, in the middle of, of filming. filming. Oh, I'm so sorry. And oh, as okay. we were, we're in the middle of filming, as we were. Things are about to get crazy, Tyler. I know. I apparently we're going to so. have to take like four steps in. So we want to actually thank those that um, that actually have made Out and About possible. Yes. And actually, we're the only media that showed up here tonight. Well, so we did. We want to be able to say, do continue to keep doing this. So keep our journey going and, we and keep it possible. Our sponsors. We do love our sponsors and we do thank you for supporting us so that we are able to bring these things to you live because not everybody can be here. All right, that's going to bring the segment to an end. We want to thank you for joining us. We'll see you once again when we're out and about St. Armand Circle. <laughs>